What I want to talk about specifically is Christopher Wren's most famous building, St Paul's Cathedral, and even more specifically, the dome of St Paul's Cathedral. So that was the decision for the, for the dome that we all see, a hemisphere. But there's a slight problem. There's a slight problem with the hemisphere because it's not actually a particularly strong shape. So he sketched the X cubed graph in his picture of the not one, not two, but three domes of St Paul's. So that's really cool to see, and it's what a wonderful uh, mathematical marvel that the, the domes of St Paul's are. You've got a catenary, you've got a cubic, you've got a hemisphere. So Christopher Wren then, architect, yes, but look how mathematical his work is. 